Again, here uh, I am to have a look at a question that uh, nobody seems to have answered, and we'll see if we can provide Craig an answer to this one. How do you check the size of a OneNote file in OneDrive? I can't seem to find the details of the size anywhere. It's a very interesting question because uh, it actually comes hot on the heels of this message here, which came from Microsoft. Uh, and if I jump across, I'll be able to see that uh, this was the message using Microsoft OneNote effectively. Use of OneNote has grown massively and uh, the way teachers and students use OneNote will have a huge impact. Microsoft have released important advice to remind users about common causes of syncing issues and that is overly large OneNote files. So some users have created files that are gigabytes in size and Microsoft has given some different advice and they're also telling us to use the app rather than OneNote 2016 from Office. So um, use the, the OneNote app for Windows 2010. In terms of this uh, advice, this is um, the information that Microsoft has supplied. Uh, best practices, choose the way to add your content, content directly, inserting links, embedding stream rather than attaching. Avoid embedding large files. Um, keep your recordings concise and so on. So there's a whole bunch of um, tips in there. But getting back to uh, the question that Craig had, how do we find out how big our OneNotes are? Because remember, we're talking about cloud syncing. Uh, we're uploading and downloading, and if you've got a gigabyte file, um, that's gonna take forever to download and sync and upload and sync changes and so on. So that's why uh, people are getting frustrated with it. They're simply um, making their OneNotes grow too large. Um, so let's see how large they are and where you can find them. So if we jump across to our OneDrive, that's where your, uh, your OneNotes tend to be stored, um, either there or in SharePoint, uh, you'll find them. But the way to find the size of the file is not that obvious. It's, it's obvious that Craig's been trying to find and looking. Um, it's not obvious at all. So what we do is uh, go into OneDrive, click this little gear at the top right, the settings, and choose the option that says OneDrive settings. And when we do that, it will show this page, uh, which is notification settings. But on the left, if you choose more settings, uh, there's a whole bunch of options in here. And the one that you want is called storage metrics. And when we click on storage metrics, we'll see our what's called our site collection, which has some numbers against different things. But again, where are the OneNotes? So what you need to do is go into documents. And inside documents, what you'll find is a section called notebooks. And notebooks is where you'll see the different notebooks. I don't have very many in my personal OneDrive. So, uh, but what I can see is that this one here, the student diary is 76 megabytes. This one here, the teacher planner is 66 megabytes. So that's where you can go and find the size of your OneNote collections. Remembering it's not just one file, it's a, it's a collection of files. And uh, all of that information is gathered under storage metrics. Hope that helped and uh, see you next time.